Hi, this video is intended for users of uh, Virtumart, which is extension for Joomla uh, for uh, e-commerce. And uh, actually, I would like to help you how to sell products that do not sell only by pieces, but also uh, sometimes you need to sell, for example, carpets uh, that sell in square meters or some liquids uh, uh, that sells in liters and uh, with this plugin you can do so um, normally Virtumart lets you sell only uh, regular pieces like this so you only can uh, two three or so pieces and uh, in my example I will show you how to sell carpets that sell in uh, square meters so you can enter uh, amount like 1.3 and it works with comma and dot 2 like this or like this and it al also works with uh, multivariant in uh, Virtumart so you can really use it like this and also this plugin lets you um, count dimensions so maybe sometimes you want to sell something like three times five like 15 square meter and it counts it automatically or you can also have three dimensions and it will count it automatically uh, so uh, you can do it all with uh, iStrax custom size plugin that can be bought at extension search mark net in products custom size detail and now I'm going to show you how to set up uh, the custom field of this type and then assign it to a product so when you install uh, the plugin usually uh, normally uh, by manage and install here and I already have it installed so I don't do that now um, then you go to Virtumart custom fields and you create a new custom field that is a plugin or plugins you only select You select iStrax plugins custom size here and this opens them. I'm going to show you a couple uh, examples how to set this uh, for my uh, types of uh, products which are carpets. So I already created a couple of them here and yeah. So um, this is uh, for selling square meters. Uh, this, uh, this is just a title and right here you can see that it's in square meters. Uh, here it says number of square meters and what is important is uh, to set this value to number of decimals that you want to use. So uh, I selected two so uh, they can uh, enter, for example, 1.56. And what is important to set this number to 1, because uh, then it uh, multiplies by the value that they enter into the field. And you can also set some uh, minimum value for that. Um, so these are uh, products with square meters. Uh, then I have... Um, another one which is similar and is for selling common meters uh, which is uh, for some types of uh, carpets that are they have some width and they also can sell uh, by 1.5 meters or so so the setting is very similar 
I only uh, don't have uh, square meters here. The unit is a couple, just a regular meter. And then I have pieces because uh, in order to sell uh, products in square meters and common meters, I had to um, had to override the template and I had to hide this part uh, that you can see here uh, through uh, CSS. So I only have this uh, this button add to cart and uh, the plugin enters a field where they can enter amount right here and now these are pieces so uh, you can use it also for products that uh, sell on regular pieces and uh, you don't want them to be able to enter number like 2.6 so it rounds it automatically like this and the only difference in this setting is that you don't set the decimals to two right here see so this is zero and then it rounds okay and now when you have these custom fields ready you can assign them to products so we can choose product and this one is um, flooring that sells in square meters. And we see that we have assigned this plugin normally just by selecting the plugin and it adds it here. And it's already set up um, according to the default setting. So you don't have to do anything else, just save the product and it's there. So I already have it. I don't need to add it once more. Also, if you wanted to customize this text somehow on, on this particular product, you can do so. But uh, normally, if you use uh, the same setting for all of them, you don't have to do anything, just save them. And it works the same uh, when you want to sell something by pieces. You just select uh, the custom field that you have for pieces and the one that you have for common meters. So that's basically it, and you can I, can I can show you how it works with multivariant two. Here is uh, the carpet that sells by uh, common meters. So it changes or like this. It works. The only disadvantage is that when you put it into card, then you cannot change the number anymore it doesn't work anymore so here it doesn't work uh, but uh, anyway it w works quite fine and uh, I hope that maybe sometime in future uh, it will work uh, with the card too so that's it and if you want to see more videos uh, just subscribe to our YouTube channel at Stavebnice, use it Stavebnice and you just subscribe and you can see more videos about uh, Virtumart and Joomla and thank you for listening.